As we age, the way our bodies respond to nutrition changes in profound ways, especially when it comes to maintaining muscle mass. If you're over 70, you're not just dealing with the gradual loss of muscle known as sarcopenia, you're also facing changes in how efficiently your body uses the protein you eat. Decades, eggs have been celebrated as a perfect protein. They're convenient, nutrient-rich, and contain all nine essential amino acids. Here's the truth. Once you're in your 70s, there's a protein source that can stimulate muscle repair and recovery even more effectively than eggs. And that's high quality whey protein isolate. This isn't marketing hype. It's a direct reflection of how your physiology changes with age. Your muscles don't respond to smaller doses of amino acids as they did when you were younger. In younger adults, even moderate protein intake can trigger muscle protein synthesis efficiently. But in older adults, the muscle becomes less sensitive to those amino acids. This is called anabolic resistance. What that means is you need a higher quality digesting protein source that delivers a potent surge of leucine, the amino acid that flips the on switch for muscle building in your body. Whey protein isolate is one of the richest natural sources of leucine, and it's absorbed rapidly, which matters when your muscles are recovering from exercise or even the normal wear and tear of daily movement. The neuroscience behind this is fascinating. The health of your muscles isn't just about mobility or strength. It's deeply tied to brain health. Muscles are reservoirs for amino acids that your brain can use to maintain neurotransmitter balance. When you move, your muscles release myokines, chemical messengers that influence brain function, reduce inflammation, and support neuroplasticity. A strong body isn't just a foundation for independence. It's a safeguard for cognitive health. People with more muscle mass and strength in later life have consistently better outcomes when it comes to memory focus and resistance to neurodegenerative disease. But if you're over 70, you, you can't rely on old habits. You can't just heat, eat enough protein and hope for the best. You have to be strategic. Whey protein isolate offers the advantage of density and speed. You can get 20 to 30 grams of complete protein in a serving with an optimal leucine content and minimal excess calories or fats. For muscle recovery, timing matters. Whey protein shortly after resistance training or even after a long walk provides your muscles with exactly what they need when they're most receptive. This is when the muscle cells are primed to take in amino acids and repair themselves. And here's the bigger picture. Every rep you do in the gym, every step you take on your walk, and every gram of high quality protein you consume is not just preserving muscle, it's preserving your independence. The chair you get out of without help, the groceries you carry, the stairs you climb, they're all expressions of muscle function. And that muscle function, in turn, protects your brain. Maintaining muscle in your 70s is about uh, protecting the quality of your life for the decades ahead. If you want to play with your grandkids, garden, read books with a clear mind, and live on your own terms, you have to think beyond just eating healthy in a vague sense. You need to make intentional choices, exercise regularly, lift weights even if lightly, and prioritize the kind of protein that works with your physiology today. Not the physiology you had at 40. Whey protein isolate isn't a magic bullet, but, but it's one of the smartest tools you can add to your daily routine. Your muscles are your health insurance policy for your future. Every day you choose to fuel them with the right nutrients and challenge them with movement, you're making a deposit in that policy. And trust me, when you're 80, 90, or even 100, you'll be glad you invested. When you think about aging well, most people imagine avoiding disease, keeping their memory intact, and staying mobile. They don't often realize that all three of those things are directly connected through muscle health. It's not just about being able to walk or lift something heavy. It's about maintaining the metabolic machinery that keeps your brain and body alive and functioning optimally. Your muscles are an active organ system constantly communicating with your brain through biochemical signals. Every time you use them, you're sending a cascade of messages that tell your brain to stay sharp, your metabolism to stay active, and your immune system to stay balanced. Here's what the research shows older adults who maintain greater muscle mass have significantly lower risks of cognitive decline, falls, fractures, 
and even depression. And the common denominator in preserving that muscle is high quality protein combined with resistance training. The challenge after age 70 is that the body doesn't respond as quickly or efficiently to standard protein intake. You might eat an egg or two, feel satisfied, but your muscles don't get the surge of amino acids they need to trigger robust repair and growth. This is where whey protein isolate comes in as a superior option. Acid profile, especially its leucine content, acts almost like flipping on a light switch inside your muscle cells, telling them, building now. Eggs still have leucine, but not in the same concentration, and they digest more slowly, which matters when your recovery window is limited. And let's be clear, this isn't about bodybuilders or trying to look a certain way. This is about functionality, the ability to get out of a chair without help. Walk up a flight of stairs without losing your balance. Carry a bag of groceries without straining your back. These are the real measures of strength that determine whether you'll live independently. The more you invest in your muscle health now, the longer you preserve not a, only your physical freedom, but also your mental clarity. From a neuroscience perspective, physical strength and cognitive health are inseparable. Your muscles produce BDNF, brain-derived neurotrophic factor, which acts like fertilizer for your brain cells, encouraging the growth of new neural connections. That's why regular movement paired with the right protein is, a, is one of the most powerful neuroprotective strategies available to you. Think about it. By simply nourishing and moving your muscles, you're protecting your brain from decline. So if you're over 70, here's the simple, powerful habit resistance train at least twice a week, walk daily, Within 30 minutes of that activity, have a serving of whey protein isolate, 20 to 30 grams. Make it a ritual over weeks and months. You'll feel the difference not just in your strength, but in your energy balance and focus. Aging doesn't have to be a slow surrender. It can be an active process of reclaiming what's yours, one deliberate choice at a time. Your muscles are listening. What, what they need and they'll give you your future. Think about the daily actions that seem so small now but become monumental when strength starts to fade, standing from a low couch, bending to tie your shoes, over a curb, catching yourself when you trip. These are not just movements, they are the building blocks of independence. The loss of these abilities doesn't happen overnight. It's the result of years, sometimes decades, under training the muscles, and undernourishing them with the, the right kind of protein. The irony is that most people think they're eating enough protein, but they're not paying attention to the quality, the timing, and the amount that actually matters for someone in their 70s or beyond. Eggs have been a staple protein for generations, and they're still a good food. When you compare them side by side, with whey protein isolate for someone who's facing anabolic resistance, there's no contest. Whey is absorbed rapidly, delivering amino acids directly to the bloodstream in a surge that your muscles can use immediately. That surge is critical because older muscle tissue doesn't respond as well to a slow drip of amino acids. It needs a bold, loud signal to start the rebuilding process. Whey sends that signal more effectively than almost any other natural protein source. Here's something most people don't realize maintaining muscle mass after 70 isn't just about exercise and nutrition in isolation, about the way those two interact with your brain and nervous system. Every time you perform resistance training, whether it's lifting light weights, using resistance bands, or even body weight exercises, you activate motor neurons that strengthen the connection between your brain and, and your muscles keeps your movements coordinated and your reflexes sharp. When you pair that activity with the right protein intake immediately afterward, you're reinforcing that brain-muscle connection while giving your body the raw materials it needs to physically adapt. If you skip this step, your body still tries to repair itself, but it's like trying to rebuild a house without enough bricks. The effort is there, but the results will be limited. Uh, that gap between what you ask your muscles to do and what you supply them with, with widens. Eventually, you find yourself doing less, losing more, and spiraling into the very decline you wanted to avoid. This is why precision matters, knowing that your recovery window after activity is when your muscles are most receptive, knowing that leucine-rich protein, like way isolate, is the fastest way to send the build signal 
And knowing that consistent training and fueling will pay off in ways you can feel every single day. When you look ahead to your 80s and 90s, not just being alive, but being capable, walking without assistance, lifting your own bags, cooking your own meals, and living without fear of falling. That future is built on the choices you make now, and those choices start with something as deceptively simple as what you put in your body after you move. Give your muscles the signal they need, and they'll answer with strength, stability, and a body that still feels like it belongs to you. Imagine waking up one morning and realizing that your body still moves the way it did decades ago, not because time has stopped, but because you've been training it to resist decline. That's the hidden power of building and protecting muscle late in life. It's not about vanity, it's about resilience. When you strengthen your muscles, you're also strengthening your bones, your joints, your cardiovascular system, and yes, even your brain. This interconnected system thrives when you feed it properly and challenge it consistently. The science here is clear. Muscle tissue is metabolically active, meaning it burns energy even when you're at rest. The more muscle you have, the more efficient your metabolism becomes. That helps regulate blood sugar, uh, keep body fat in check, and maintain energy levels throughout the day. This isn't just about metabolism. It's about the chemical conversations your muscles have with your brain. Every time you contract your muscles, you're sending molecular messengers into your bloodstream that cross the blood-brain barrier. These messengers influence mood, sharpen focus, and enhance memory. Two-way relationship. Your brain controls your muscles, but your muscles also protect your brain. When you hit your 70s, this relationship becomes even more important because your nervous system isn't as quick to adapt as it once was. You have to give it stronger, clearer inputs. Resistance training provides that stimulus and way protein isolate amplifies the result. It's the combination of stimulus and supply telling the body, we need more muscle and then giving it the exact building blocks it needs to follow through. Eggs still play a role in a, a balanced diet, but they simply can't match the rapid absorption and leucine punch that way delivers, especially in the critical hour after training. One of the biggest mistakes older adults make is waiting for a problem before they act. They wait until they've lost noticeable strength, until they've had a fall. A doctor warns them about bone density or muscle loss. But by then, rebuilding is harder. Not impossible, but harder. The key is to get ahead of the decline before it accelerates. Just as you wouldn't ignore your finances until retirement, you shouldn't ignore your muscle health until it's at a crisis point. Think about your future self, the one who still gets on the floor to play with great grandchildren, who still drives on long road trips, gardens for hours without back pain, who still wakes up clear headed and motivated. That version of you isn't built on luck or genetics. It's built on daily habits, on consistency, on knowing that every time you move your body and feed it right, you're investing in the life you want to keep living. Don't underestimate the simple, powerful act of adding whey protein isolate to your post-activity routine. Dismiss light resistance training as not worth it. Just because you're older, your body is still capable of remarkable adaptation. The question is whether you'll give it the reason and, and the resources to adapt. That's your choice, and it's one you get to make every single day. Longevity is not just about adding years to your life, it's about adding life to your years. After 70, the difference between merely existing and truly living comes down to strength, physical strength that supports your independence, neurological strength that keeps your mind sharp. Eggs have their place, but if you wanna give your body the most effective signal to recover, rebuild, Stay resilient, whey protein isolate stands out as the smarter choice. It delivers the amino acids your muscles are craving in the exact form and timing that aging physiology demands. Pair that with consistent movement, especially resistance training, and you create a feedback loop of vitality that protects your mobility, your cognitive health, your independence. Every day you choose to move and fuel strategically, you're building a future where you still control the pace of your life. Strength is not a gift reserved for the young, it's a reward for those who invest in themselves, no matter their age. The work you put in now will not just change your body, it will preserve the freedom to live on your own terms for decades to come. 